last time on RPG, uh, you guys uh, started your journey to find your father, Richard Roxov. And after a little bit of issue, uh, <laughs> after, after a little bit of issue, both uh, finding the group and determining what is and isn't a fountain, you... <laughs> You uh, headed to a local tavern to find a uh, pickpocket that had stolen from you and <laughs> started a bar fight. Hell yeah. <laughs> which, uh, Only a little bit of bar murder. Yeah. <laughs> which, yeah, exactly. Which was overwhelmingly... <laughs> ended with bar murder, yeah. <laughs> which ended overwhelmingly in your favor with uh, everyone involved either knocked out or dead or just <laughs> running away from you. Which is where you found the guy who pickpocketed you, who not only gave you your money back, but also gave you a tip about a uh, about a gang holed up in an abandoned warehouse that was last seen with, well, you don't know if it's your father, but it was a bard. So now with that lead, you guys are you guys are making your way out of the tavern, uh, kind of to figure out what to do next. Okay, uh, but for, before we leave the tavern, he, okay, um, he he did say that he he was like pretty buddy buddy with with the uh, the bar owner way back when, right? Uh who the the pickpocket? Yeah, or not the pickpocket, the bard. So the bard was employed there. He was like the tavern bard until this all happened. Until like uh, right. he he was the tavern bard at first, but then when the bar got like uh, robbed by these uh you know by this by these gang members, he just stopped showing up. So assumingly, so assumingly he is so he was an employee that is assumingly <laughs> part of this gang. Fair enough. Oh, let me get the let me get the ambiance back up. Back up. We got you got to so make the YouTube thing, right? Or are we doing watch together? Um, what's the play here? What are you guys thinking? Well, you said that you didn't like that the watch together actually blocked specific uh Song. Oh, I, Song. That, that's true. That that I didn't like. I also um, the watch together what, what, songs. Well, no, yeah, I, I think the, the YouTube activity. thing is also called Watch Together. Oh, I think that's what Paul okay. was referring to. Referring I mean, to. If you got a I meant the website. I mean, like if you got a playlist, I'd probably just go with that because, like, again, ads also pop up when you're using like the Watch Together thing. In theory, you could also just like stream it. I do. No, but then you guys will. See, but then you guys will see if I'm checking my notes. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Hmm. This is your fault for only having one monitor. Now you can have it in its own. It's in its own window, but yeah, it's more of a pain. That to too. Yeah. Oh, if you have it in its own window, and then I was gonna. Use, then you didn't get me. You didn't get me. You didn't get browser. me ads the last time we did this, right? No, I didn't. I did. Then I, well, as long as the person, He's the one is, recording. as long as the one recording isn't wasn't getting any ads, I feel like I'm fine with doing the. Could activity. you imagine? Could you imagine you accidentally record a YouTube ad and then they copyright strike your um, video for having an ad in it? That'd be funny. <laughs> you see Rage Shadow Legends in this recording? Yeah, that's Rage copyright. Shadow Legends is <laughs> RPG now sponsored by Rage Shadow Legends. Subscribe now, and I get fifty thousand tokens, and you get use the through. code Fat Pikachu, <laughs> <laughs> dude. If Fat Pikachu doesn't come back next season, I'm stealing him. I'll I'll steal your fucking character. No, you're not allowed to use Fat Pikachu. You don't get to say his what name, do you bro. Mean I'm not allowed. This is our. You're not allowed to use Fat Pikachu. Imagination is the limit, buddy. Yeah, you can use Fat Pikachu's Pikachu. name out of your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> You can't be Fat Pikachu. Yes, fuck yes. What's Fat Pikachu in Thorben's stance? Oh, fuck, dude. Oh, shit. Dude, wait, I didn't... Dude, I played that whole campaign of Thorben Stringley, and not one time did I try to shoot someone with a stand arrow. I am... 
Bro. Fuck, that's that's actually, worst. That, that, that's that's actually embarrassing. Worst. That's yeah. actually the most embarrassing thing I've ever heard. I hate myself. I'm you should actually myself. kill yourself once RPG is done. I'm real life now. I fucked up. Right. You should actually do that. But if he does, how do I get him on him to do that? Damn, cynical. Hell, <laughs> dude. Yeah, that's fucking age description. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> anyway, after this brief right. intermission. Yeah. So... You guys, uh, so you guys make your way out of the bar and onto the the still very sort of like dirty and dingy, but thankfully not very, uh, you know, thankfully not very crowded back street that this bar that this tavern is on. And we are on the back streets. I see a man with a bow. I want it that way. <laughs> uh. Uh, I'd say unless that way. <laughs> unless you guys have anything else you want to attend to, I'd say you can probably give me like an intelligence and either streetwise or I don't know, let's let's okay. make it intel let's make it Hold intelligence on. streetwise to Stay... find... Hold up. Let him less. finish. No, I need intelligence to streetwise less. to sort of like Look for the area to look for the general area where this guy outlined that the hideout was. I'm hideout. getting a little bit of echo from somebody. Right, right. Oh, that's probably me. I'm, I'm waiting for my phone to. Oh, there it is. I'm gonna are, play are, on my phone. Oh, just, were were we dead. healed? Or are we still. Uh, all my, all our health was back up when we I, started, so I assume so. I don't think. I don't remember what your guys' health at, but I don't think there was really a chance to heal. I don't know. Yeah, I'm worth five out of six. You guys weren't healed, but I put in the values just a few marks. I think someone took some damage, but... No, I died five out of six. I don't remember. Yeah. It, it does it does matter for me, because I don't have healthy. Lol. Well. <sighs> Two successes, yeah. by the way. Good. Brown, you gonna flip your card? No. Oh, freelance. By the way, just uh, yep. so you know, on a flip with no successes, there's uh, there's a there, we have a mechanic called dramatic failure. Oh, I where you can, failure. It, okay. Okay. You can uh, you can add a joker to a flip that has no successes or jokers, and uh, it gets it uh, it will grant you a, uh, a an extra XP, which is used to like upgrade your character extra between feet. sessions. An extra feat, yeah. Alright, bet. Alright, so that's... One, oh, sorry, that's three successes. Oh, I'm supposed to be You've doing a flip, too. I'm supposed to be doing one, too. Yeah. yeah I mean, if you oh, want to... I was just responding to a message, sorry. Just don't? <laughs> Dingle is talking. I think I'm at five out of six. Look, five, five, fives. Five, there's five fives right there. Holy shit. Dude, oh, oh my this is going to be a great flip. I just know it. One thing says. You didn't flip any fives with it. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> One king in the middle just to give me hope. <laughs> that was an attempt. I'm never see. You know how I usually use drive all the time. Now I can never use drive. That's my new character. It's kind of crazy. Oh, okay. I can only use it to drive now. Are you dramatic <laughs> failure in freelance? What happened? Are you uh, doing the dramatic failure? No, not yet. I'm just taking that all down. Okay. No, oh, yeah. dude. Fucking dramatic failure. Do you even know what dramatic failure means? You you, you can you can dramatic failure or whatever. It it's it, it's not like a limited thing, and it's just anytime you have a success anytime you have a flip that's just like zero successes zero jokers you can mm -hmm. add a joker to it for a feat yeah, you get a free nice. xp for it they give you xp like in dungeons and dragons for it all right but you but it does fuck you over i mean it's a dramatic failure yes i assume so <laughs> <laughs> So, w w was that all right, step. like, an all right you're doing it, or an all no, right? No, it's just like, all right, I understand. No, he I'm understands. Just okay. Out. Okay, cool. Uh, all right. So, I'm going to say between a bit 
uh, Suki and Marty. I'm going to say you guys are sort of able to, like, roughly piece together where it is, and you kind of, like, you're, you kind of, like, are bringing uh, Nathan and Benson along. They, they're not really super confident navigating these kind of, like, winding, like, back roads. Yeah, I think these fountains on the wall should take us there. <laughs> <laughs> So, but about uh, about halfway through, Benson, you get sort of like, you, you sort of like hear what sounds like, you hear what sounds like music, and you're like, oh, music? Wait, may, oh, maybe, <laughs> you're like, maybe, I, maybe the bard's this way. And you like try to tell people that, but everyone's just sort of like, so focused on trying to navigate around they don't hear you so you're just gonna you're you go and follow to the over to the source of the music on your own i'll be the first one to find him <laughs> <laughs> so uh the, the the rest of the party uh will make it to the hideout but first let's uh, uh I, I, let's fuck. we're gonna resolve this joker <laughs> As you sort of approach, and there's just kind of like this street performer just kind of sort of lazily kind of uh, just sort of plucking at a guitar. Ah, uh, it's it, been so many years. Where did you go? He, he looks up and just sort of visually goes like, Oh! Uh, <laughs> oh, uh, sorry about that. You, uh, you scared me. Uh, uh, you're not gonna eat me or anything, are you? No, no, I, I'm just gonna take you back down to the underworld to meet Mother again. <laughs> <laughs> um... Charm intimidation. <laughs> well, the thing is... So here's... Uh, Alright. For this flip, I, okay, I feel like I feel like this flip can go one of two ways. If you want that to be received as scary, it's charm intimidation. But if you don't want it to, it's charm empathy. All right, it's charm empathy. <laughs> roll a, uh, I'll pull an outer king. I'll, I'll pull a, uh, pull a hero P. Oh, okay. Oh. Just kidding. He he has no clue what you're talking about, but he can tell that you uh he, he can tell that you don't he can tell that you don't mean any harm. And he's now kind of like treating you less like a, a monster that's going to attack him and almost more sort of like a lost child. He's just go and he just sort of goes like Oh, uh So did you you lost your mom? I mean, I, I, I don't. I, maybe I could help you find her. Does she also not have all of herself? Uh, yeah, she's dead. Her, her spirit went back to the underworld. <laughs> ah. <laughs> um. <laughs> he kind of like. He kind of like looks around. To tr <laughs> he, 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 he. Listen, uh, I'll, I'll tell you what. I can. I'll take you over to the police station, and they can just sort of look after you. <laughs> <laughs> well, mother told me not to really trust the police, but I mean, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you're taking me to the station as my dad, but... Who? Me? Benson said fuck 12. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I, I I think there's been some mistake here, kid. I... I have definitely... I... I don't think I'm your dad. <laughs> Oh, well, 
I didn't think it'd be that easy anyway. Wait, so okay. is, this happening, is this happening near the rest of the party? No, he's totally no, he's he's this is This is happening pretty removed from the party. Okay, can I try to find my way back to the party then? Uh, hold on, I think... Uh, I was gonna make this guy flip to see if he could be, just be sort of be like... So is there... Okay, so you don't want to go to the... Do you know anyone in the city? Are you here on your own? No, I, I'm with all my new brothers. There's a there's a car. There's a tree. There's a samurai warrior. There's even a, a robot. Can you believe it? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, all right. So he's gonna he's gonna see what he can oh, do. Oh, he's a bro. To... He is a bro. Oh, well, he's not a bro anymore. All right. Just grown. <laughs> this is an amazing start. The did you flip the bro did you flip the cop from the bros deck? He's not a cop, he's just a street performer. He was just gonna he take cop. He was just uh, gonna hey. take this lost child to like the authorities because he didn't know what to do with him. Cops <laughs> never <laughs> flip from the bros deck. A critical fl a critical failure means he's basically an undercover cop. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, dude. All right. I need to think about how this is going to be resolved. So we're going to go to the rest of the party. <laughs> All right. So let's say that. Benson and this guy are sort of over here. They're kind of struggling to sort of find their way back as Benson kind of just gives, like, in directions that don't really make a ton of sense to him. And so you guys eventually, after, like, a while of wandering around, you sort of, uh, you approach this... You, like, approach, like, this sort of, like, alley that seems to lead to, like, a warehouse. And you see two dudes, like, leaning, like, against the wall nearby that are dressed kind of like 1950s gangsters, but with wizard hats that are in, like, the same- that are made of the same material as their suits. <laughs> and as you kind of walk up to them, you're just like, Hey, hey, hey! This here's private property! <laughs> I don't care. We're looking for someone. Out of my way. He kinda like, he kinda gets in here, he kinda like blocks your path and he just like... That's oh, not I'm how it works, bucko. Mind. I promise you, whoever you're looking for ain't anywhere near here. Uh, so, uh, why don't you Su turn around and beat it? Suki is gonna go right up to his face and with his kind of like... Oni eyes are gonna start glowing a little bit. And uh, he's just going to go, I said, get out of my way. And he's going to start unsheathing his uh, katana. They always and can I do them. an intimidation check for this? Yeah, oh, fuck. Good. We just got started and we're back to combat. <laughs> intimidation. I'm sure this will go well. And I'm healthy. Suki just wants the smoke. this will go well. Oh, Ooh, not bad. See? Okay. Not the worst. Suki kind of snarls just a little bit, showing his pointed uh, oni teeth as well. So, uh, this guy's like, this guy's a little, this guy's a little taken aback, but he's like, sort of unfazed. He, he's he's a bit like less unfazed. He he steps back a bit, and him and the other guys sort of go shoulder to shoulder. And their hands begin glowing a little bit, and just these sort of, like, glowing, kind of, like, magically created what looks like Tommy guns just sort of appear in their hands. And they're just like... Okay. So, how about we count to three? Does that... That, that a good enough head start for you? Sure. Are you sure that's enough time for you to start running before I cut you down? One, 
<laughs> I start taking out the sword more. Two. I slash him before it gets to three. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> All right. Agility yeah. brawn, I assume. Or agility yeah. uh, melee, I mean. I'm going to use a I feel like ben has, has an, like, hero point. Fully process oh, yeah, boy. By the time everything starts going down, he's just like, oh, so this is what we're doing now. Okay. Oh. Uh, all right. I know. All right. I know how I want to handle this. So you you like go ahead and you like slash at the one guy, and you get him like pretty fucking good, like. To the point where he's kind of, he kind of, like, staggers back, and he's just sort of, like, just sort of, like, laying on the ground. But the other guy is smart enough to kind of, like, back up while also sort of just, like, peppering you with, like, magic bullets from his gun. And so you're gonna have, uh, you're gonna have two damage dodgeable incoming, as this guy is just kind of, like, just sort of, like, now just kind of... Oh, this is where the Joker was, though. Joker. Alright, so yeah, this guy's just kind of, like, booking it away and trying to get back to the warehouse. I am As the other to... guy is kind oh. of just, like, lying and bleeding out on the ground. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Suki just kneels down on the ground and goes, oh, I gave you fair warning. Damn, you got him, dude. I was gonna. Oh, I had a whole fucking rap planned out. <laughs> oh, I got God. one of them. Uh, is the other guy still within like uh, I like I view like eyesight? Uh, yeah, sight, but I he's mean. like he's like sort of like he, he's running pretty fast away. I catch up to him with my with my wheels. <laughs> uh, give me agility driving. <laughs> So uh, I'm assuming that that magic Tommy gun disappeared. Yeah, they're they're just yeah they're not like real weapons. They're just sort of like <laughs> summoned weapon. They're just sort of like summoned guns. Damn. I just really like I catch up to him with my wheels. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing can now run a Dodge Challenger. And, uh, I'll put a drive on there. Also, and whoever said I'm resorting to violence, my character's literally half-demon. What do you want him to be? Every, like, come on. Everybody said that? No, that is what Someone I said that. He's literally half-oni, and oni are known ah. for, like, um, for friggin', like, you know, burning down villages and shit. Like, what do you want him All to right, do? Alright, boys. I'll, I'll catch him. I'll catch Flat you. tire. I fucking just, oh, I jammed in reverse. Alright, <laughs> All right, no, this is this is perfect. So you uh, you like successfully ca you like successfully catch up to him and just sort of like run him down in front of the warehouse. <laughs> and he's just kinda like he's just kinda like you, you like hit him and he's just sort of like on the ground he just got he's just gonna Hey we got a couple of wise guys trying to break in! And suddenly you see, like, the windows on, like, uh, up high on the front of this warehouse all just sort of, like, drop. <laughs> and <laughs> you are get and just shots, like, just, and, like, magic shots, like the ones that the two goons did, just sort of, like, fire out from the windows and are just gonna, like, Pepper you, Marty, for uh, two damage undodgeable. <laughs> Fuck. And as you kind of like, you have you kind of like r run back. You kind you like drive, drive back. back to join up with the rest of the group. Or actually, you know what? No, I know a perfect way to do this. Um, 
You run into Benson by driving. You're literally. about to you're you're about to turn and drive back to the rest of the group when you see Benson <laughs> and someone that you don't know just like walking towards you from this direction <laughs> as the shots are being fired. Just like it's like Benson, get down! Hey, here's the car I was talking about. <laughs> brother, <laughs> brother, <laughs> brother. To help me, brother. <laughs> help you with what? As gunshots are being fired at <laughs> at my car. <laughs> what's that? What's that weird noise? Weird... Gunshots being fired at me, a car. <laughs> oh dear God, it hurts. Right. So, uh. I'm gonna say so. Okay, so I'm gonna say uh, Marty and Benson. You got. Uh, uh, I'm gonna want like an agility driving and an agility athletics to get uh, to get <laughs> through the hail of, of magic gunfire unharmed. <laughs> it it wouldn't be halved. It'd just be normal. Okay. Was that just bro? Yeah, it's not. Um. I, I'm, I'm gonna say you have to do it too because you're also you you also have to like walk through it. And actually, oh, I said... so does the, and actually, so does the guy with you, come to think of it. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? Agility Athletics? Yeah. It's only agility driving for, uh, for Marty, because he's a <laughs> What the fuck? Why? Why on this? Oh. <laughs> the bullets pass through your bones. You don't even feel anything. <laughs> no, 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 no. My brother's here now. Why would we run away when we could run towards them? <laughs> when we could attack? That's not the intention. You can't change the intention of the role. It's agility driving. I can drive wherever I want. I'm a car. I got a crit plus five, dude. I, uh... <laughs> All right. I <laughs> climb on my hood, Benson. Climb on my hood. <laughs> <laughs> yes, brother. Sorry. Yes, brother. <laughs> Let's see. It is a it, that is six successes. Uh. Well, shit. These flips are brutal for you. Okay, I mean, do you guys want to? Do you guys yeah, want we're, to we're like cra to have, crash into the door together? We're trying. Yeah, we're trying to have a uh, Nick Cage as um, oh, what's his name? Oh, something Rider. Oh, jeez, how can I forget? The dude who turns his head into a flaming skull who rides on a motorcycle. That's not Knight Rider. No. No. Uh, oh, that's no. Ghost Rider. Ghost, ghost Rider. Rider. Yeah. So Yo. we're gonna have a Ghost Rider. Me and Benson having a Ghost Rider moment here. I become Ghost Rider. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, no, it's. Cool. You know what? You know what? Fuck it. I'll let you guys do that. <laughs> do you want to do you want to take the guy who was with Benson with you or is he going to join the rest of the party? I feel like he's coming along with us for the ride. All right. Uh Skeleton Benson no with tire and oh look his head is on fire. <laughs> I meant to say now with tire, but yeah. <laughs> you know what? Okay, so Benson, I'm gonna say you I'm I'm gonna say you like I'm gonna say you run for it and you and you jump on top of sort of like just the top of Marty. <laughs> just sort of like just sort of like grabbing the uh your just sort of grabbing your street performer friend and bringing him with you. Who is gonna take? Who who is actually gonna take some uh, <laughs> shots? Because he got no success. He is gonna take some damage because he got no successes. Whereas you, like, yeah, like all of the bullets just hit the just hit the skeleton side and just barely like whiz through the open bone. <laughs> And 
gonna say this. Like is, this isn't technically combat, but I'm gonna say that this is this is a this is a tense enough moment. And you put on megalovania. <laughs> More like gigalovania, if you know what I'm saying. What's up? <laughs> so So now <laughs> we've uh we've kind of split the party again because you guys are going to crash through the door to this warehouse as like dudes kind of like are like as some of the as the dudes on like the ground floor that are sort of nearby the door are kind of like scrambling around just kind of like Whoa, holy shit. They drove, a, they, they drove a car through the door. I am a car. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys, oh, well, what's hey. going on? One guy was about to say, oh, well, hey, at least we got one of them. And then you said that, and his face just goes white. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I'm going to say that you, they are going to draw some magic guns on you. But I will say we'll, we'll get back to yours in a bit because there is kind of the matter of the rest of the party just sort of seeing this and being like, huh, well, what do we do? <laughs> uh, well, well, Mr. Instigator, run in there. Finally, no more pissing around. Suki is going to run in there. <laughs> okay. Uh... Agility Athletics. <laughs> and I am oh, still healthy. Damn, I'm gonna use two drive. Oh, oh well. I don't want to use any more than that. Alright, I don't know if anyone wants to run with him. Uh... Maybe after I see that, like, he actually did do what I said, it was like, ah, damn it. Um, but I do, and yeah, I'll run with him, but I do want to uh, see if I can, like, pick up one of those, like, pinstripe wizard hats. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's agility athletics for anyone who wants to just straight run for it. I'll let you pick up the, I'll let you pick up the wizard hat. Sick. <laughs> it's, wait, wait, wait. Uh, can you I can, use drop no, I, I was just looking at what my agility was like. You can add a, uh... <laughs> add, like, a wizard... You can add, like, a wizard gangster hat to your, uh... Let's call it non-useful for now. I don't know what yeah. benefits it would realistically give. Also, uh, this is, I meant to ask you this at the end of the last session, Dingle, but yeah. you said I can cast with presents, right? Because I'm a bard or whatever? I... I'm, a, I'm, yeah, I'm assuming that bards can cast with presence, since that's sort of the, uh, like, you know, like, in, in Zell's campaign, whenever my character, who was very music focused, like, whenever he played an instrument, we would do presence uh -huh. before. Yeah, because you so do, I, like, so I would assume that it, damage a lot of the time. Yeah, so I would assume that, like, you know, using a spell that's also, like, playing a song would be, okay. you know, would... Could I, that could just pop, hmm? could I pop my one in into presence instead? I'll, I'll drop the fucking uh, practice. Uh, yes, but let's say not this session. Yeah, I'll wait. I, I'll wait till I'll the end. Have of no, I'll have no fucking clue. I'll, I'll, that'll just confuse yeah, the no, shit no. out of me. I'll wait till the end of the session. Sorry, I just meant to ask last time, and I fucking forgot, so... Okay, one success, three successes, and a joker. <laughs> <laughs> it's good, I feel like Freelance needs some play. He hasn't used his Australian voice, like, the whole time. Yeah, no, 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 no,
would take me on a fucking. What brain happened? She might right, you know, a freelance, he's been rooted. Watch a little VP. Wait, is he supposed to be rooted? <laughs> Long neck. Do I make it inside or what? Making a little VP. Long neck. Just make it into because you're a tree. <laughs> so. I'll say. I'll say everyone is. Everyone is gonna, like, make it inside. But, uh. <laughs> I was not expecting you guys to just run for it. Um, <laughs> Me neither. There is going to be... Okay, so... With three successes, I'll say... Uh, bit, just sort of like being a smaller target and also made of metal... Ma makes it like a little... Makes it like... Makes the hail of magic gunfire a little bit easier on you. And you're going to... You have six dodge. No. I was, about to say, I was about to say, that's crazy. Thanks, Agent. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. I almost had six dodge. <laughs> Alright, so... I'm gonna say, you're you're gonna be taking... Well, you're gonna be taking one damage. Uh, Sukigawa, on the other hand, you're just kind of, like, bull rushing your way in. Which kind of makes it really easy for them to just pepper you with bullets for three damage. And then... Good old Nathan. Uh. You... Nathan, you, you're sort of like... You're just sort of like... You, you're like just sort of like follow along. You're you're not really sure what's happening yet, and you just sort of like walk into the gunfire and don't realize until just tons and tons of bullets hit you. Uh, I'm gonna say you're you're taking six damage on dodge. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, no, I can't <laughs> <laughs> as as your your massive size co combined with like not immediately trying to like run through it just lets them like absolutely just pepper you. Yeah, I can take. <laughs> but afterwards, you guys. But afterwards, you guys are gonna make it inside, where. You see, uh, you see the people who busted their way in are, like, just sort of, like, in a bit of, like, a standoff with a, with a couple of, with a, with a couple of gangsters already sort of levying guns at them. And I am gonna say that combat will start here. <laughs> yeah. I thought yeah. we were already in combat. I wasn't going any other way. Uh, Any uh, enemies out there? At the beginning of a session? Uh, no. In combat with us? Uh, I'm gonna say there's like there's like three guys and they're tor sort of like they're kind of like trying to take like defensive positions like among like the boxes in the warehouse. So they're kind of like I, I mean I'm gonna say they're kind of like still just sort of like they're sort of just like blind firing around the boxes at you guys there's no damage incoming from it yet but it's just something to be aware of as it goes to sukigawa's turn uh this is this is really exciting i got to like cut your guys's health basically in half before this combat um, nice. I want to see how well I'm doing before I do, before I, before I say what it is, but he is going to do sort of a forward sword slash. Like just, he, he's just running forward and just slashing with his sword. All right. <clears throat> and, uh, and I'm going to pre-hero point this. Not bad. Um. So the kind of so uh, Suki just kind of running into the middle. Actually, you know what? Can I can I uh, split the damage among all three of them to do like an area of attack? Yeah, 
Absolutely. Uh, so what the so Suki runs up, unsheaths his sword, and does like a huge forward horizontal slash, and uh, say, and uh, says, uh, "Fitting that you cower behind cardboard because I'll be cutting you all down like paper." Okay, so you said so 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 you said you were running into the middle, correct? Yeah, my my uh my brawn and agility are the exact same, so. So I, the role didn't matter. Like the Ooh, that right. specific part didn't matter. Okay. Yeah. I will say. Uh, so, <laughs> so so you you kind of like you you slash forward, and it seems pretty. It seems pretty effective. It just sort of like it's able to like just barely like penetrate the boxes, and you can kind of just sort of based on intuition can tell that it kind of. Some of the impact made it through to the other side. Okay. That said, several bullets just sort of like are flying all around you, and one is about to like hit you just square in the face before another one collides with it and kind of dissipates the blow. Oh shit. <gasps> uh. Wait, you, what? You, Was there a stray you, bullet, or...? No, so... You get the impression that while they're blind-firing behind boxes, not being in cover is maybe a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> and, at, and with that, it'll go to Marty's turn. Oh, it's my turn? It is your okay. turn. Okay, okay, okay. I'm fucking. I'm, I'm rolling the windows down. Oh shit! <laughs> Sorry, I gotta find fucking relics sound real quick. My bad, quick boy. Here we go. It's gonna fuck. Relics. I roll my windows down. I turn. I turn the bass all the way up. I say, or I let. I let Mimsy do a funky beat. Your hands they glow, as does my flow. But as you know. Rhymes a sacred mo, so I'll turn your arms to slugs and you'll fire slow. Is <laughs> <laughs> gonna turn their slug. arms to slugs? I'm turning their arms to slugs. <laughs> give me, well, uh, give me, give me presence and. I think spirit. We made the bees spell spirit, so I can't, I think we gotta keep that. Hey, you're, you're channeling living energy, I guess. Yeah, I yeah, guess. Yeah. Transmuting yeah. one living thing into another. Yes. Yeah. Uh, you know what this is? I just realized it's because we watched fucking JoJo yesterday. <sighs> And everybody turned to a snail. That's why I was just thinking about it. <laughs> All right. Uh, from from behind the from behind the box cover, you can tell you can hear just kind of like you hear kind of like a shimmering sound, and then a very kind of like wet slap <laughs> as the uh, as. The uh, the magic the 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 oh my god he's got he he, he so actually epic, put dude. that hat on that's awesome <laughs> tips wizard hat <laughs> is there any way to give it like it like a like more spot that's invisible maybe hmm? like that's it that's well I was thinking like is there a way that you could make it so the picture is like longer than it actually looks so like, yeah you do, put it over your thing that's what I tried to do. All right. Uh. So. <laughs> I'm gonna say I'm gonna say the 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 gunfire is gonna stop for this round of combat. <laughs> and these guys are gonna be. It's gonna be a little bit harder for them to control <laughs> their weapons with slug arms. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking god, dude. That one's for my boy, dude. That one's for my boy. Okay. Uh, can the can the four initiative boys 
flip one card for me? Oh, fuck. You've got to beat a jack. You got That's Nathan and Benson, by the way. That's what I mean by the four initiative, boys. <laughs> Just take one card. I oh, did not know how much this of Iron Foot Rip. That's actually pretty good. Deuces! <laughs> Snob. <laughs> Pair of fours beats one jack high, though, let's be honest. <laughs> so true. true. Pair of four definitely right. beats jack high. Y'all getting Same wrecked. Season. Hey, That's and they're the four up. initiative boys, and they pulled fours. Yo. That's Damn. gotta count for something, Dingle. It no, super it doesn't. doesn't. <laughs> that was not oh, damn! <laughs> this doesn't count for shit. What are you doing? <laughs> Dingle just a hater for real. <laughs> oh fuck! I, I I tried taking a drink out of my cup, but the lid was on it. Dude, you drink out of a cup? Fucking gross, dude. Fringe. Is what it the you? fuck you drink yes, out of, dude? I drink out of a fucking drinking glass, man. I never. I wouldn't drink out of. <laughs> I'm not gonna drink out of a cup, dude. Someone dick and balls has been in there. What? Cup <laughs> my nuts, yeah, that's bro. True. <laughs> Gross, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm not gonna drink out of a cup. Uh. Alright, so two of the guys are trying to, to form their guns with the slug arms, but really <laughs> just sort of can't do it. <laughs> one guy, one, one guy, like, gets it fully formed, but it just, like, drops and dissipates as soon as it hits the ground. Did they joker? The other guy the, the, the other guy is gonna is gonna see this and just be like Huh What the hell? Uh and he's gonna He's gonna rummage around like in the he's gonna rummage around in the box that he was on. It is he, he like sort of like the, it was a, oh, all right. This will work. And uh, <laughs> he he lifts a slug. He lifts his slug arm out, and there's just like, and there is a, uh, <laughs> and there is a grenade in the mouth of this slug. <laughs> <laughs> in the mouth of it. <laughs> What's this factory making? And he's gonna, <laughs> and he's just gonna. Toss it. I'm gonna. He's gonna toss it right. I feel like it has to be Suki's way because he is throwing it with a slug. <laughs> he's gonna get caught in the crossfire too. I'm like right here. <laughs> Throw behind you. I don't know. He's, he's sitting behind a box. You think a box is gonna stop a grenade? No. You know what? Yeah. You're right. Let's Depends say. On the box. I think yeah, that let's say there's bug. there's one damage dodgeable coming towards both Nathan and Benson as it sort of lands in the middle of them, sort of just sort of like lamely. <laughs> one dodge is all I have. It's all I need. Yeah. All right. So yeah. So <laughs> these guys are still behind boxes. This guy is now like on top of his stack, like just sort of like. Just sort of like rooting around in it with his slug arms. <laughs> As it goes to Nathan's turn. Uh, <clears throat> you better take that dodge off, dude. Nathan's Look, going I'm looking, at, I'm looking at you guys' dodge, like they didn't even take it off, dude. A couple of freaks. It's yeah. fine, I know it's not there. Nathan is just going to uh, let out a most Australian roar and uh, slam his fists into the ground, trying to um, basically tondre up the uh, roots from underneath, I guess, the black pawn, and try to like basically pull him into the ground or crush him, whatever the hell's going to happen first. Oh, shit. Okay. A, a true blue Australian roar. The Dingo so Man tries to enter a warehouse, and there's a tornado in the background. This tree is just like, oh. I feel on... like, I feel like I'm willing to give you brawn spirit for that because it involves like a slamming motion. And uh, can I use a hero point for that as well? Uh, yeah, you can. You, okay. you can use a hero point whenever you want. The only rule is that you can't use more than one hero point per flip. I know that. Was that what's the hero point add? Just one card or two? Two, two cards. Two. One card for drive.
Well, unless you're unless unless I'm, you're I, driving. I, yeah, unless he's driving. <laughs> Two more cards. And that's what the little counter is for your name too, it's just to keep track of your hero points. Holy shit. Fucking hell, dude. Okay. Okay? You fucking slam the gun. Oh, he slammed the gun. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> he bought he bought he won't slam the gun. Uh freelance <laughs> kind of uh going off though. Damn damn, what are you, your dad? You got bullets on my block, mate! <laughs> So, you. He's a fedora with your hat. What? Sorry. I my. My thought it wasn't like a fedora wizard hat. It was like a wizard hat made out of the material you'd expect from a fedora. I know, but I, that makes it. I didn't even like register in my head when I thought about it at first. But I'm looking at the and, hey, <laughs> and it's too perfect. All right, so. You sort of like slam your fists and just uh, oh, it's like so a bunch of vines sort of like come up and wrap themselves around the bottom of the crate this guy is sitting on, and just kind of throw it up into the air, and it lands like sort of like open side down on this guy when it hits the ground, and you just sort of hear. <laughs> As it lands, you hear a click. Another grenade <laughs> went off. <laughs> As this this uh, this box of grenades is just going to explode. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so it's like it. that guy's uh, definitely he, gone, right? Like he's just that gone. guy's that guy's super gone, and these guys are kind of like knocked to the floor. As their sort of a, uh, as their cover just is like completely just sort of like in shatters, obliterated, pretty obliterated, and uh, <laughs> then it's gonna go to Benson. <laughs> um, so I'm still right by Marty. Is that right? Uh, yes. It, it, in fact, unless, in fact, I, I'd say you're probably still on top of him. All right. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna pull off some of my uh, finger bones and plug the hole in Marty, the, the bullet holes in Marty, <laughs> to uh, try and heal him. That's kind of gross. That's that's fucking nasty, <laughs> but I love it. Uh, give me uh, intelligence biology. Well, hmm. <laughs> is it okay? Wait a minute. So, is this biology or engineering? Because you're healing a car, but you're healing it with biological parts. I, I'm not engineering anything new onto it. I'm just, uh, I'm plugging I, holes. I feel, like, I, I feel like I'm gonna go with my initial flip. I feel like the fact that you're using bones to patch the holes makes it more <laughs> biology. Healthy and grace. And a hero point. God damn. Let's go. Three <laughs> Let's and a joke. Go. All right. Uh. Okay. okay. Uh, this is, all right. I know exactly what to do with this. Uh. So Marty. You just sort of, <laughs> uh, you just feel this, like, strange sensation kind of, like, plugging the bullet holes. And at first it's kind of, like, a, a relief, because you're like, oh, that's, oh, that's good to know. But then you see what they're being <laughs> plugged with. <laughs> and I, I'm gonna say, you're, you're so grossed out by what has healed you, that it is gonna heal the three health. But for your next three actions, you're gonna flip as if you weren't healthy. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, isn't this the second time where where Benson's tried to do something like this and it's a similar outcome where he's tried to heal his choker? 
this has happened almost every time <laughs> Benson has tried to do, like, a benign action to help someone. Benson sees Marty angling his rearview mirrors to look at what's happening and he goes, Yo, this looks so cool next to your flame decal, don't you think? And Marty is just about to throw up. <laughs> Can, can you describe the scene to me one more time? I'm I'm pulling so, bones off my fingers and uh, plugging the bullet holes with them. <laughs> my bullet holes? Yeah. 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 Dear God, so you? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> What's the issue? Well, that's fucking disgusting. <laughs> I mean, bang. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get way. I'm gonna get way better aerodynamics now. Yeah, for sure. But I motion to the rest of the group. Who, Guys, come on. This who, looks cool, right? That's probably the most. Waiting. That's probably the most disturbing thing I've seen today. I, I puke up a little motor oil and uh, and um, you know washer fluid. Yeah. Hey, uh, d don't don't let Benson heal me. <laughs> Okay, sweet. Everyone's so mean to Benson, but it's so funny because he's just disgusting. <laughs> no, it's so perfect, though. I like Benson the idea of a heal that no one likes. <laughs> <laughs> this, campaign's already, this campaign's already going in the history books, I think. Uh, alright, alright, Bit, you're up. Alright, um... <laughs> there any more? Oh. So I, I just, like, I, I just... Moved yet? Um, I, you kind of cut out there for me. I just like ran in there. I really moved and where you? No, yeah, you're. You're still sort of like more. You're still kind of towards the door. Can I see any more like grenade crates nearby? Ah, uh, or in a warehouse. I wasn't sure how oh. plentiful those were. Crates in a warehouse, I freaking wondered. Alright, alright, I'll tell you what. I'll let you look for them with a wit investigation, and depending on how high you flip, you could potentially throw one. Bet. Um, I have one wit, that's funny. Low, Lamaui. <laughs> LOL. I've got investigations, fine. I've got a hero peak. I need to put it in the TPS. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> Throw a drive on it. Or two. That sounds like or such a sarcastic three. laugh. I have two. Ha, 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 ha. I have two. Yeah. Did you HP it already? Yeah, I did. Damn, dude. Alright, well, three's not, not bad. Three's not bad. Alright. What's, the, what's the other one for? What? I'll give you that. Okay, so I'm gonna say you you do run over and you find like you sort of find on your search that like it looks like most of these crates have like some form of either like weapons or like weapon sort of components in them. Okay. And you do find another crate of grenades and you kind of like you're you're being a little careful with them after seeing what happened to the last person who met with one of these. But I'm going to say you grab one and you kind of lob it over, and this guy's able to sort of scurry out of the way, but this guy is going to, like, not quite make it out in time and kind of get his back ripped up by a grenade. Oh, yeah. As it goes to, uh, as it yeah, and I'm hot, like using it as cover, of course. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna say the the, uh, the 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 street performer. He's gonna kind of like he's gonna be like. Hey, what the guys? What's going on here? I think that I think that guy over there is really hurt, and he's gonna run over and sort of as he does, he's gonna kind of like he's just sort of like he's gonna like accidentally kind of like trip and fall over this guy as he's getting up, 
and sort of the 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 pain of someone like falling on his like grenade singed back is just gonna be enough shock to knock this guy out. <laughs> So you're not entirely useless after all. <laughs> what? I... Hey, is that guy... Do you think that guy's dead? Because, I certainly like... hope so. No, because, like, I've got, like, like, okay. Because, like, I've got, like, because I've got a record, so, like, I really kind of can't go down for killing a guy. He died in combat. Is that such a crime? The Killing people a is a crime, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't think you're gonna get away with that one. This so place is... You know, if someone questions you, I, I'd the probably laws of this uh, land avoid... Are, the laws of this land are absolutely asinine. I mean, I'm with you there for the most part, but, like, I definitely don't want to go to jail for killing a guy. I'll kill him myself, then. Just to make sure, and uh... Okay, so you guys gonna... all heard that! He did it! <laughs> so this guy's unconscious, not dead, though. No, he's not dead at all. He's he's just like... I mean, he's like very badly injured, but... Nuki is gonna dead. kick him to try and wake him up. <laughs> like, kick him in, like, his ribcage. Okay, I, I, I do want to remind you that it is your turn, so this is an action. <laughs> Ah, shit. Oh, so it's not over until he's actually <laughs> no. dead, huh? Well, well, this guy's well, guy just kind of like... This guy's sort of like in the corner trying to create a gun with his slug hands. I'm gonna... Suki's gonna walk over to this guy instead, then. And, uh... Put his sword to his throat. And say... There was a bard spotted here recently. Do you know anything about that? And please, try and be as straightforward as possible. I'm not in the mood. Not in the mood for anything. I, I was just- I was picturing you just like walking up to it Kill Bill style and just having the sound. Yeah, <laughs> well, I mean, we I need information. Like Kill Bill yeah. style? What? That's what the pot's Have you never seen right. Kill uh, Bill, Brown? No, what part of Kill Bill, though? You know, the part with the katana? You know, like, That's like most of the movie. I guess she did have a katana in Kill Bill, yeah. He was asking Kill Bill what or two. Oh, I don't yeah, know. That's what I, was asking. I think one had the most. Uh, one had more of that. Blood. Yeah. Is one the yeah one's the one where she fucking does like the big. Yeah, she, she fights Lucy. Crazy, right? Okay, the point is, I'm trying to get information out of yeah. this guy. <laughs> oh, God, I need to Kill Bill. God, I need to fucking rewatch Kill Bill one and two. Holy shit! Those movies, no, I re Those movies are you? amazing, and I don't think I've seen them in like five years. Would you believe me if I told you I rewatched them to to study for this role for this character? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> to make study sense. for this role. <laughs> they're gonna be. They're gonna be a part of this campaign where, Su where Sugi's just gonna be like, wiggle your big toe. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, can I intimidate Turns this guy to get information? No, yeah, out of him? yeah. Flip, uh, flip presence intimidation. I, I already flipped the guy's response to it because I knew that's what this flip was. Hell, Damn. yeah. Wow, that fucking sucks. Oh well, it was gonna happen. His voice crooks. <laughs> Let Dingle figure it out. I'm not trusting any of y'all. Accidentally stabs him in the throat. That would I would be okay with if you're one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I know how to do this. So he he is able to crack off like one slug gun shot in retaliation, <clears throat> but uh, when it. When it just sort of like it, it's gonna deal one damage to you, but it's not gonna look like it did. Oh. So now this guy, so so this guy, a after that he just kind of like he's gonna demake the weapon and just be like, uh, and just sort of put his hands up and just be like, uh, all right, yeah. You got me. If you want to keep your windpipe in one piece, start talking about a bard that was here. Oh shit, we're windpiping. 
Oh no, dude! No, no, please, God, no! Also, I was like, "Damn, thank God, Cynical forgot he's the anti-Joker." Oh, I am. All right, let me keep that in mind for later. <laughs> I mean, imagine if you used it right there, I would have been bashing my head against the table. Nah, I'm okay with taking one. I think I honestly kind of like that because it scared the guy into thinking that I was fucking like bulletproof. So I kind of like that. He's just kind of like he's kind of sitting there with a. His his slug arms are up in the air, but like they're kind of looking around. I definitely I'm definitely <laughs> I'm definitely visioning that like unless they're like actively using them for something, these are live slugs. So they just kind of do it. <laughs> if they're not like act, if they're not actively it. using their arms, they are just kind of like squirming around. He's <laughs> just like you're, you're you're here for that deadbeat? The boss had us. The boss had us keep him here because he wouldn't pay off any of his gambling debts. What was his name? That asshole's name? I, uh, I don't know. I mean, we didn't. I mean, we didn't process him. We just tied him up and threw him in the back. You can. Uh, I mean, you can ask him yourself if you want. Of course. Wait, Dud's here. Don't get your hopes up, Benson. This could be someone else. But it's the only lead we have. Uh, it wouldn't be the first time today. <laughs> Better than nothing. Now you've got two choices. The, the, the street performer Kai kind of looks and just like he's just like. I, can somebody tell me what's going on? <laughs> you've got two choices, and Suki's just gonna kind of lightly put a little pressure on the sword, not enough to hurt him, but just enough. Now you've got two choices. You leave and never speak of this to anyone ever again. And you never cross our path. Or I finish the jump now. Hey, listen, man. I mean, I'm no snitch. But I... You're not I, I... Then leave and live a coward's life. Oh, he's cool. he hey, hey, bro. Away. Hey, so we're we're cool now. I say. Hey, so we're cool now, dude. To the guy who's who's yeah. cynical, is trying to make leave. Cause that was crazy, man. That that whole thing back there. That was. Cra Are we cool now? You're lucky. I'm in a generous mood. Uh, yeah, man. I mean, we're we're cool. We're totally cool. All right. I I hey, I got you, bud. Listen, hey, buddy. I got you. Slugs of the enemy. You're not my friend, but with no fight in you, their hands again. <laughs> I turned his hands back into hands. I want to make you flip for that, just because it has the potential to be really funny if you I'll fuck do it, it up. Yeah, yeah I'll I'll do it. it. So give me, give me another uh, present spirit. Slap HP on your fucking dude. Okay. Nope, it's just a good flip, dude. It's just actually just a nice little flip. Just a solid flip. I, I feel like I feel like two successes. His one for each his, arm. Yeah. yeah I'm gonna say, uh they're they're still visibly covered in slime, but he does have human arms again. <laughs> it's, he looks at he he kind of looks at him and he's just like, oh thank God. <laughs> now leave yeah. before I change my mind. Yeah, they pro they probably would have never changed back otherwise. So I just thought you know if you're getting out of here now, you know you're not we're not fighting you anymore. I don't want you know let bygones be bygones. Bury the hatchet right now. You know what I mean? Hey man, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, the guy. Yeah, the guy's out. The guy's out back. In fact, you know what? And he Leave kind of all like, your blood will be forfeit for the thieves. <laughs> he, he like uh, he reaches into his pocket and he's like, and he he pulls that he pulls out a key from it, and he's trying to hand it to you, Marty, but he doesn't <laughs> quite know where how to give it to you. I'll take the key I, out of it. I, I fucking no, no no I do a donut and I pop my trunk. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> he just sort of places it in there, and he's kind of just like, "It should I? Are you gonna close it? Should I? Because my hands are still kind of." Yeah, if you could close it for me, sorry. I can close it myself, but it's like kind of, it's not as easy if just someone does it for me. Okay, sure. I just wanted to make sure because, and, and as he's sort of saying it, you can <laughs> tell why he was hesitant too. As there's kind of like a slosh, a sort of sort of like a squelching noise as the slime-covered hands just sort of close the door. Oh, it's it's all right, man. You know, I just I got a whole bunch of, you know human motor oil all over my paint job earlier anyway, so I'm going to have to get a wash. Oh, that that's what that is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you guys have some weird motor oil. I don't know why it's red. It so right. freaks me out. Yeah. You guys are so weird. Like, where's all the mechanics? Like, come on. I haven't seen one other car. <laughs> yeah, that's... Staying uh... away from me, because I'm a freak. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Uh, I'm going to go. <laughs> and he just starts booking it. He just starts sort of like power Leave walking now. away. Traumatized for life. See yeah. So, so Marty, you now have a uh, you now have a slimy key. <laughs> it's either traumatized for life or we kill him. So, works out oh, for him, I guess. Well, if I can kill him, I'm a fucking roots, and I'm gonna probably feel a little bit fucking better after that fucking beat down. <laughs> Let's just go. <laughs> Marty, come with me to the back, and everyone else, I guess. Let's go see who this bard is. I try not to kill him, Suki. Yeah, kid. Seriously. You too. Stop cutting everyone up. I, I, what do I do? I don't kill people. Well, maybe if people just <laughs> stayed out of my way, I wouldn't have to resort to violence. It's not my problem. I go, to the, I I go to the street performer. Hey, you want to meet another bard? Maybe you guys could be friends. <laughs> I want to imagine Benson is saying that while in the background, all of these other guys, like all of us, are just covered in blood and shit. Uh, sure. Uh. <laughs> this, uh, this, this street performer who, <laughs> it's funny, I, I came up with a name for him at some point, but none of you guys have asked it, which is fine, but I just think it's funny. <laughs> the, uh, the still nameless street performer just kind of looks at it and he's just he's like visibly terrified of you guys and then he's just kind <laughs> of like he even though he really wants to leave he doesn't want to say no to you so he's just gonna be, uh, yeah let's go yeah, what's your name by the way new traveling companion new friend of ours to, to join us in our adventures I wouldn't go that far He's part of the family. Really. Yeah, he's part of the family now. <laughs> Hostage. <laughs> so what's your name, pal? Oh, uh, I'm uh, I'm Matthias. Uh, a lot of people call me Maddie, but you don't have to if you don't want to. I mean, I'm not trying to presume that you have to call me anything in particular. <laughs> you can actually just not talk to me at all if you don't what want it? to. What was it that people call you again? Oh, uh, Maddie, mostly. Maddie, dude? I, it's short for Matthias. I'm not sure if I mentioned that. Matthias, shut up. Mm. <laughs> mm. I'll have to think of a better nickname for you. Matt, Let's Maddie. just go. We're wasting time on Maddie Moo. <laughs> Alright. Uh... So you guys sort of like are are heading. You guys are heading to the back. Of you guys are heading to the back. I, I'm get, you're staying on the ground floor of the warehouse for now, since there are still uh, there are still a bunch of dudes up top. But it seems like they've taken the silence to mean that they were successful and not you guys. <laughs> <laughs> and eventually. Stop. And eventually, sort of, uh, in, you kind of, and eventually you reach this sort of, like, it looks like it, it was kind of, like, cobbled together, kind of, like, back room with, like, a door, with a door on the front. Just like a, it almost looks like someone built a shed inside of this warehouse. Is the door locked? Marty, pop your trunk. The we need the key. Oh, no, no, I, I got it. I can unlock doors, don't worry. 
Just no. Just I got this. Unlocked. I got the physics figured out. I just need to know if the door is locked so I can describe it. The the door the door is locked. <laughs> okay. So okay. Somehow, um, the key that was put in my trunk appears in your teeth. Wait. Uh, you cut uh, out after it, Brown, saying. Are you okay? Here. Brown, are you okay? Brown, I ah, dead. What the fuck happened to him? <laughs> Brown fucking died. I the guess. The key appears. His headset get fucked up? One Somehow, second. the key appeared. <laughs> <laughs> we need to get Brown to record a bunch of different, like, letter and syllable noises, and we can just put him into the TTS. Make, him, like, a voic- make him a vocaloid? <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, yeah, sorry, my mic broke right, right in the middle of me saying that. So, That's, what yeah, it seemed. Like, That's what it seemed like. <laughs> so, yeah, some, somehow the key that was put in my trunk uh, appears in my mouth. I don't want to even I ask begin, how I that's begin, possible. I begin using my mouth. I got it, guys. I got it. Jesus Christ. I begin using my mouth to unlock the door with the key. Please make me roll for it. <laughs> <laughs> Please make me roll no, for no, it. No, 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 no. <laughs> Please make me roll for it. I'm dying. <laughs> okay. Uh. <laughs> give me... Or I know the perfect role for this. I'm ready. Give, give me uh, agility biology. Yeah. <laughs> agility biology. Oh. Do not anti joker wow. this flip under any circumstances. No, I joke. won't. Agility and biology. No, he's saying don't anti joker it if he fucks up. No, I got a king, dude. I fucking got it, dog. <laughs> dog? Yeah. I unlock so, the door, but I can't open it. Yeah, you, your, your tongue is somehow dexterous enough to hold this key and turn it inside the lock. <laughs> it, it tastes, uh, you, it leaves an absolutely disgusting taste in your mouth. <laughs> it's the combination of, like, the metal key and slug slime. <laughs> but the, the, you do hear a click signifying that this is the right, that this is, in fact, the door that you were given the key for. Well, I it'll, feel like it would it'll jump up and, and turn the knob and open it. <laughs> I feel like it probably tastes triply bad because... It did. The key did move from my ass to my mouth. Yeah. Don't have to keep describing it, please. <laughs> well, let's I just move to. on. But I want to do though. No, I shut up. That's a whole. That's a whole disgusting conversation on cars. Cars biology, but I, I'm. <laughs> Because they do have human mouths, so that would imply that there is just, like, an anus in the trunk. Can we move on? (laughs) That's the exhaust. (laughs) How do you think I was born? But yeah, so, you, uh, you spit the door open, and you see kind of, like, you see this dude, like, tied up in a chair, and, like, right next to him is what looks to be, like, kind of, like, Sort of like the goons you've seen, but he's in a nice... He's in a much nicer suit and fedora wizard hat. He says, hey, hey! What's the big idea here? We've come for information about this bard. This guy? Hey, I can give you all the information you need. Uh, then what's he doesn't his name? Know who to, he doesn't know what horse to bet on, and he doesn't know how to pay his fucking dues. What's his name? Oh, this ass clown? This guy's Billy. Oh, we're out of here then. See ya. Yeah, see ya. Yeah. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. Don't leave me here, please. We're we're looking for Dick, dude. We're looking for Dick. We're looking for Richard Roxoff. Yeah, we're You're not him. I know where he is. We have no more need for you. Hey, look. I don't. Come on, I can help you out. I mean, Richard Rogsoff, I mean, every bard knows about that guy. He's a legend. It's not about knowing about him. Do you know where he is? Oh, totally. I can help you out, man. But, uh, and he kind of, he kind of, like, makes a little gesture with his eyes towards the guy. Like, listen. What's even happening? <sighs> wasting time. I'm going to go up to this guard and, uh, I'm going to go. Hey, come on. Fr- just... Just free this guy. The fedora he, wizard? He he has information on our dad. You know he could just be lying, right? 
He's probably fucking Wally, mate. No, 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 not me. <laughs> like, hey, go. He he, kind of he kind of goes over. He, he kind of looks over to Matthias, just like he's just like, come on, man, help me out here. I mean, you're a bard too, right? And he just and he ah, uh, me. I listen. You know, was I a bard at one point? Yes, <laughs> but I can't legally practice bartery anymore. <laughs> so I mean. I don't know. I'm kind of with these guys, and I kind of don't want to not be with these guys because I saw them turn a guy's arms to slugs and then blow them up. <laughs> Boy, you can't legally be a bard anymore. Are you? How is being a? How are you illegally being a bard? Listen, it's a long story. Okay, go bard. ahead. Okay, it's not that long of a story, but I don't want to tell it. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter anyway. It's not going to help us. There's room for one more in here. You know, respect, the man, you know respect Maddie Moo's privacy, dude. Fine. That, oh, that's going to stick, isn't it? <laughs> the illegal <laughs> bard. You're some so sort we... of outlaw musician, then? <laughs> yeah, that's the word. Can we try? I will, we I will see, say, I, who's got empathy? Can we see if Billy's lying about knowing Richard Roxon? Well, I will say, I do want to resolve uh, what Zedrin was doing because it looked like Zedrin was trying oh, okay. to Sorry, charm. My bad. I will say, Zedrin was trying to charm Timidate the bar, the the guard. Charm of <laughs> Timidate. Chimid, I like Chimidate. 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 That's that's Chimidate. the Benson exclusive action. I like mixing words though. It makes me, it reminds me of rap music. Makes you think it's like the intellectual flips. Hey yo, oh, he kind of spitting though. Yeah, kind of spitting. Dude, para aces on the draw, dude. All it's in free flop. Aja or jaw. He's German. Oh, all, right. all in free flop. Yeah. So pretty fly for an undead guy. Pretty fly for an undead guy. Thick and base. This guy. <laughs> It takes a moment for him to, for this, like, it, it takes a moment for him to realize, like, who exactly is talking to him. And then he looks down and sees you and just sort of jumps back and he's like, Hey, whoa, <laughs> buddy, I think you've got to keep this guy on ice. <laughs> what are you talking about? It Look, is pretty warm in here, I agree. It's just like that. That's our brother, Benson. I think he was your brother from the looks of things. <laughs> no, I, I'm still their brother. Unfortunately, but go on. Listen, are, listen. Are are you with this guy? Are you here to like bail him out or something? We're here strictly for Richard Roxoff. We had a tip that there was a bard in this factory, but now it seems like it's not the bard we're looking for. We have met two bards today, and neither <laughs> of them are the one we're looking for. Yeah, but this guy's information on our dad. That's right. Mean? You should listen to your friend. I mean, he said it, so it must be true. Yeah, how many deadbeat bards are we going to find before we find Richard? Yeah, it seems like every bard we run across is either a deadbeat, not legally a bard, or is in trouble with the mafia. Is it just the profession? What happens? I mean, I could, I could tell you about that, too. I just gotta get out of here. We don't want to make any more mess of your warehouse, like, and well, I just asked you to outside the door done. where it's just chaos. <laughs> Come on, just just let him free, you know. Uh, I'm gonna say he he looks outside. And he looks. He's gonna see blood, burnt, like you know, <laughs> scorch marks. The guy, he's just gonna sort of like take a moment, and he's just gonna look at, and he's just like. You can tell we don't All right, take but no listen, for an answer. He's like, all right, but listen, Billy. You got one more week. All right? The boss has had it up to here with you. Any more? Yeah, just, uh, uh, just up front, if you're coming with us, we're not helping you with that. Yeah, no. You still have to worry about this obligation. Uh... I mean, I guess I could help. I'll take it. I'll I'll I'll, I'll take it. Just uh, <laughs> hey uh, listen. Uh, 
Oh, listen, Larry, just untie me, all right? Then we can, uh, you know, and then I'll be on my way with these folks. And, you know, they are actually going to take me to the bank where I'm going to get your money. <laughs> what are you talking about? I know about? that's not fucking true, Billy, but I don't, I, I don't have got fucking time for this. <laughs> and he sort of unties him and kind of like... <laughs> once he unties him, he just sort of like tips the chair over so he falls out of it. <laughs> if Suki was standing in front of the chair, he's literally just gonna stand aside as that's happening. He's just gonna step to the side. Yeah. Like, Alright. Get out of here. And hey, you guys. What? We got a big race coming up. A lot of good names on the line if you want to put some money down. We got good odds. We got good odds. Can we go to the races? And you're gambling? Wait. We're wasting time. Wait, there's a race? A horse race, Marty. I don't think you're allowed in it. I want in. <laughs> Marty, you're a car, not a horse. I want in. Marty, no. No, 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 no. This no. is different. This is different. No. no. Listen, we got listen. We're do listen. We're doing you listen, you know what? The boss isn't supposed to hear me say this. But <laughs> I'm you giving boss. people twenty. To, I'm giving people twenty to one odds on Pony Boy, and I know that's crazy because he's a shoe in to win. But I'm telling you, I'm telling you, we can make a little bit of money here. You're saying a lot of things that don't make any sense. <laughs> Listen, I'll tell you, I'll tell you something right now, buddy. I could beat Pony Boy any day of the week. Marty, it's a horse race. So paint a horse on the side of me. What? <laughs> That's my point. I could fucking work. Oh my god. Uh, we may need more trip money. You're kidding. Yeah. What even is a horse? I mean, I got horse. I got horsepower. That's not the same. The guy. Nick? The guy kind of like the guy kind of starts like scratching his chin. He's just like, hmm. You know, I kind you know, I like what you're putting down. <laughs> yeah, you're picking it up, huh? With your hands. I don't got those. I'm a car. <laughs> oh, not for long, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'll tell you what. The boss, he's got an office downtown. Why don't you guys settle up? With this deadbeat here, and we could swing by there, and I, I think I think we could make this work. Uh, just be clear. Well, I'm interested. That's for just sure. yeah. Just to be clear, this guy, I don't, I, this Billy guy, don't think he's gonna be much help uh, splitting with him. You know, but think about it. if we make a little money off this race, now that could be mighty helpful. Yeah. Who knows I'm how many saying, hands we're gonna I'm, have? I'm just saying, Billy's not gonna. Who knows how many wheels we're gonna have to grease along the way? Listen, I'll call ahead to the boss. I'll let him know you're coming. Uh, Capish? Uh, Kaposh. That ain't the word, but I like you, kid. <laughs> Caprizi. <laughs> <laughs> Look, uh, we got a little bit of cleaning up to he here to do, so. Listen, you don't gotta worry about all lanky Larry. I'll I'll set you up nice. Thank you. Oh, jeez. Thanks, Larry. Thanks, Larry the Lankster. <laughs> <laughs> so he just kind of he 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 kind of like sort of just sort of like pushes his way past you and just starts like he he pulls out kind of like this weird kind of like it looks sort of like it, it it looks kind of like an old timey like cell phone almost, but just very kind of like it's it somehow steam powered. And you're just like, <laughs> hey boss, it's me. No, no, but I got something even better for you. As his voice tra starts to like trail off, he <laughs> <laughs> just and uh, and Billy kind of stands and he's just like. Ooh, I I would have been up a creek if it weren't for you guys. I can yeah, still be so right. Richard. Hmm. 
So about Richard? Yeah, tell us about Richard Roxoff. Oh, man. What couldn't I tell you about that guy? I mean... Could you tell him where, Tell us where he is now? Ooh. Buddy, if I knew that, I'd be one of the richest men on Earth. What do you mean? No one's been able to find the guy since his last world tour. It's like he dropped off the face of the Earth. But, but how would that, that make you rich? Because I could be his opening act. And then... I'd get a ton of money from that. I'd be able to pay my debts, put the extra into more gambling, and I'd be cr- and I'd be rolling in it. Yeah, well, if if you lead us to this, if you lead us to this rocks up guy, uh, you can uh, do whatever the hell you want with him. But... Well. Let's see. His last tour. His last tour. Where did he do it? It was. It was definitely down south. Ah. Ah. Man, I don't. It might have been in some kind of creepy place. Like some sort of like. Some. I think it was some sort of swamp or something. I don't know. A swamp, you say? (laughs) Down south. (laughs) Oh, do you know the place? I live there. Oh, did you see him when he was in town? Uh, I mean, he didn't actually come to the swamps. Not many people do. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, it he was came a... in him though. <laughs> I mean, it was it was a pretty long time ago. I mean, I wasn't even alive when it happened. That was like Ooh, that must have been 20, 30 years ago? Yeah, no one's been able to find that dude for a long time. Why are you looking for him anyway? You super fans or something? We're all his sons. Yeah, he's our dad. What? Ah, uh, <laughs> that dog. That's rock off <laughs> for you. <ya. laughs> Hey, listen, you know what? I'm so glad I was able to be a help, and, you know, I feel like we're super even now, so I think I'm going to get going. Is this the bard guy or the... This is the, this is the bard. This is, the, this is Billy who's saying this. Oh, okay. I'll, uh, well, uh... I'll be around, and, hey, if any of you guys see, uh, if any of you guys see, uh, Bert, the uh, the barkeep at the uh, if you, if you see Bert, the barkeeper at the Rusty Mug, uh, tell him I skipped town. <laughs> okay, and we'll tell him was that the was that the one that we beat to a pulp? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. And he just starts sort of, and he just starts like starts uh just walking very sort of like briskly out and. <laughs> As as he as he gets like a, a good bit away, uh, Maddie kind of he's just sort of like he's just like he gives him a look after him, just like is it really that easy? <laughs> <laughs> that easy to what? Oh, get away! Oh, I see. I see. <laughs> Are you saying that in character or out of character? I I, I feel like he's kind of thinking it. <laughs> Yeah, he's think- that was he's, more of a... He's still oh, very terrified okay. of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I, I grabbed Matty's hand. All right, guys, let's go down south. <laughs> <laughs> as long no, as no, we're not we wasting this- any more time. We gotta do the race first, Benson. Come on, please. No. Oh, the race. Okay, no, it's it. all just a waste of time. Oh, no. no, we need some money. Well... I guess we're already twenty I mean, I years say, late. How much? Him. How much do we have on us anyway? Cause... I think I didn't. I we didn't make a counter, but I think we determined that you guys have about a thousand. Because I think I, I determined that, that, that was meant to be in character. But... Oh. Hey, listen, if I get last minute placement, I might have hundred. It was also on. a genuine question, so thank you. <laughs> yeah, because I think I I I sort of determined just sort of in my head that only you and uh, Suki had money on you, since you guys were the only ones who had your money stolen. And I put it at 500 for each of you. Fair enough. 
So you guys are pretty fucking poor. <laughs> yeah. But 100 to 1 odds. If I get in the race, who knows? Well, I, I guess oh. since we're already 20 years late to Dad's World Tour, I guess a <laughs> quick stop at the races wouldn't hurt. <laughs> Suki has a very, uh, it's a very annoyed face. Also, I, just, I'm pissed that it But just says, uh, as long as it doesn't take too much time. Nah, it'll be quick. I mean, look at me. I'm so fast. Mm. It'll be over in no time. Oh, but what I was saying just before, uh, I'm pissed that it took me until session two to fucking realize that his name's Dick. Yeah, <laughs> it took you this long. <laughs> I, I definitely figured no one said anything about it, so I figured everyone just got it immediately. Yeah, it was an unspoken. <laughs> I got it immediately. I just got it. <laughs> Those <laughs> Randy Rocksoft boys are at it again. Well, don't worry about it, Brown. Have <laughs> solace in that you were the only one that didn't get it right away. Yeah, yeah. If I don't say, if I don't laugh or say something about it, it means I didn't get the joke. <laughs> Just have solace in knowing that you're the only one that didn't get it. I think I need to store for life back. That's my secret. I never get the joke. (laughs) That's very (laughs) obvious. Oh, shut up. (laughs) I just like I. I personally think, uh, whatever your guys's, whatever you guys decide you want to do is great. Even if it's something really simple, like, you know, like closing your eyes for just five minutes. Why would we do that? I'm not going to do that. What? Okay. (laughs) Close your eyes, then that gives you the enemy to steal. Listen, Matt, listen, Maddie Moo, is there there something that you want to talk about, man? Been acting a little strange. Oh, me? No. You know, you guys don't have to worry about me. You guys, you you know, just like pretend I'm not here. You know, maybe if you guys got really good at pretending I'm not here, you would just forget I was here at all. Why would I, why would we do that? You're you know you're part of the family now, <sighs> Maddie Moo. Why would we why would we <laughs> try to forget about you, man? Come on, you can tell. And if there's anything bothering me, you know you can tell me. You can talk to me about anything. Or Benson, you can talk to Benson about anything. Really, he's you know <laughs> he's a good listener. Oh, that's that's so. Nice of you guys. Matty just looks over my non-existent ears. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Benson, how did you meet this guy, anyway? Well, I heard music playing and I thought, it just had to be Dad. But, uh, I mean, it wasn't, but we found someone just as good. Isn't that right, guys? <laughs> <laughs> Not uh, really. Think he's looking to adopt? I hope not. <laughs> ah, you're too critical, mate. Oh yeah, I never got to ask you guys. What are you actually planning to do when we find Dad? Me? <sighs> yeah. The reason I called us all here is because when we find our father, I'm going to kill him. Oh, that's amazing! You're gonna send him to the underworld to be with mother again. Oh, no, what a I'm treat. killing him because when hey, hey, hey when Susie, he... don't not in front of Benson. <laughs> ben, Benson's just looking up at you with like what is what is as close as possible to puppy dog eyes. <laughs> Whatever the reason, yes, once we find him, I'm going to kill him myself. I thought we were gonna fucking, you know, fucking return to our fucking roots, you know? That's why I'm fucking here. No. (laughs) Return to our roots. (laughs) Ever since I knew of the existence of my father, I've only had one thing on my mind. Getting revenge on for what he did to my mother. What's that? <laughs> Pro- probably just, pretty similar to you know the rest of us. 
Ollie did was step out of her life and just left like she was nothing. Left her broken hearted. Sounds about right. Like, I'm gonna fucking angry if she's mine. I mean, listen, man, I feel like we could all, we could really all say the same. You know, I mean, we're, we're all, we're all going to kill him, right? Yeah, you guys are here I, to kill that him, is right? why I called you all here. I figured you'd all feel the same way. What are you saying? This no, man I'm has to make, live, this man has him. to sow, sow what he's reaped. The king I mean, of hell will put on a grand honestly, banquet for his return. I'll be 100% honest, I do want to kill him, but Mimsy really wants to meet him, so I'll probably have to wait a while. The moment I have confirmation of who he is, I am driving my sword through his heart. Well, I want to say you're forced advertising here. I didn't say anything about fucking killing that bulletin. I didn't say anything other than meeting... Hey, you you did kind of leave it out. Well, so you did fucking... Go ahead, but you, you think this fight? is going to have a happy ending? Yeah, mate. I thought we'd be fucking I will turn your right sword to dust, half-brother. <laughs> Damn, I'll whoa, step whoa. on your battery pack, Mimsy. <laughs> like, like, like I said, she really wants to meet him. You know, she took up being a bard after she found out he was a bard. Uh, you know, me personally, I come on. You know, that man does deserves no forgiveness from me. You need a fucking hug, mate. No. I need to yes. see the light. <laughs> I need to see the light in Richard Rocksoft's eyes dim. I like how so I like how the fucking tree is the voice of reason. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, the tree and the radio. Bring it in. Damn, I start. I uh, start. Uh, I'm gonna say, brawn empathy to attempt a group hug. I I'm gonna, bet. I'm gonna use. I'm going to use um, smooth operator for this. <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> All right. <laughs> You put John from the wrong deck, or is this everyone who's flipping? I don't no, know. This is it, it's. It, I, don't know I why think it's. Flipping. Who's? Flipping? I think unless you guys. I, I, let's start. I, I'm going to say let's start with just Brown. Just Brown. Yeah. Let him flip first. Sorry, phone. freelance. Dude, no, you're fine. Put him away, freelance. No, no I, I like them out here. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I said, All put right. him away. Put him away. Him away. So with Smooth Operator, that is Brawn and Streetwise plus two. Right, right, right. Sorry, I'm, I was just trying to scream at Freelance for keeping all his cards out. It's just like the wedding all over again. <laughs> Am I at full health? Oh, right, right. You're at full health, but you're not flipping as if you're healthy still. Yeah, I how many you've got, flips I, have I done since then? I think I think this is the last one. Oh, okay, okay. So wait, that's... Oh, okay, one, two. For the... I fucking critted Let's though. Let's go. Man. All right. So, sure so you, you guys are coming in for this hug, no matter what. But if you want to reciprocate, I'll, you could give me a broad empathy. Don't worry, I'm not flipping. <laughs> Marty does a donut and rounds everyone up. I'm just gonna use a hero point for this roll. Fuck you. I'm reciprocating, though. <laughs> We're family brothers. Fuck yeah, bros. Let's go. Let family us hug, hug it time. out. A dramatic I, failure. I, 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 I. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Score! That's what we needed. Um, you know what? While we're, uh, while we're uh, doing this group hug, uh, can I, like... I, I, I'm gonna, like, accidentally touch, uh, Tsukigawa's katana, like, psychometry it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> Shit, okay. <laughs> nice, actual legend. Uh, what a quick move. So, I'll get to the psychometry in a minute. I don't know if, yeah, yeah. I don't know if, I don't know if you want to give any backstory on it, Sin, or if you want me to just come up with it on the spot. Um, oh, okay, it's fine. Um, for the sword? Yeah. You have a second to think about it, because we're still doing the group hug flip. Do the group hug, I'm gonna think about it, but I have a pretty cool idea for it. Okay. So, you got, so... 
Again, Suki's the only one not reciprocating this hug. I want right. to make that very clear, even though I think that probably didn't have to be said. <laughs> that means that just means you're in the middle. I I really like the idea that you sort of like you sort of do donuts around the group until they're kind of like in like a very tight <laughs> circle, and then you and then you pull out like one door as far as it can go and kind of wrap it around them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, brothers! Yeah, it's good to have family again after you know after Mama died. Nathan, you kind of like or you you wrap your like big tree arm around oh. the whole around the car door, and Bit just kind of is just sort of like tapping on it very reassuringly. <laughs> this dog has a very stone faced, not impressive. I know. I, I would say you are like you are sort of like right in the middle, just like trying to keep your hands to your sides and just like just staring daggers at everyone. It's a fucking <laughs> autistic moment. <laughs> you're all fucking tree keen as far as I'm fucking concerned, cunts. You're all fucking talk blades. <laughs> <laughs> Righto, oh. Con. Righto. I will say though, as this, as as this hunt, as this uh, group hug is happening, you kind of hear, you hear just sort of like a small, just sort of like crack. Uh, Benson is gonna Benson. You're gonna take one damage, and everyone <laughs> else is going to be, and everyone else is going to be very thoroughly grossed out at the. Uh, at the realization that something just got that something <laughs> just broke in Benson from the uh, from the force of the hug. <laughs> are you hey B Benson? Are you all right? Yeah. Are you all right? Yeah, I'll I'll just drink some more some more of that special milk from the bar. Everything will be fine. <laughs> uh, okay, Cal calcium enriched or something? I yeah. don't even know what calcium is. <laughs> All right, and so as this is happening, as everyone's kind of like, while everyone's kind of focused on Benson a bit, you do take a moment and you kind of like, you kind of reach out and, I mean, I mean, realistically, you're touching the sheath, but I'm gonna say that counts for the whole sword since sure. katanas and their sheaths are kind of a package deal. Well, he could touch the handle or something, uh, that's or true. Like the guard or something. Yeah. Well, that's true. That's true. Uh, let yeah, because. Let's say let's say you let's say you're let's say the way Sukiga was holding it, you are able to kind of like get get some get like a quick touch on the actual like handle of the sword. So what is he doing? Is he getting all the information about it? Yeah. So psychometry gives you like an in depth understanding of like the I, items I mean... history and how it works. And okay. I've generally liked to deliver that in the form of like a little flashback relating to oh, okay. the Okay, I got this. I got this. I've been thinking about this. So, bit once you touch the sword, you're going to see thousands in in the span of like ten seconds. You're going to see thousands of years of history of this sword being wielded by either blue or red oni. It kind of goes back and forth, but you can assume it's all from the same bloodline, and you can see stuff like. It's slaying like giant like ghost yokai and demons and a bunch of other shit. Basically, you're gonna see like you're gonna see like a like a medieval Japanese like fantasy manga and like like a whole series of that in like ten seconds. And then the last thing you're gonna see is an older blue yokai, which you can assume is related to Suki, which is his grandfather. Uh, handing it to Suki as a very, very young man. In fact, shouldn't even be getting a sword at that age, but that's just how that rolls in that kind of Oni society and being trained to like use it as a very deadly and dangerous weapon. And that's what you see. And you've seen it's been forged in a way that the only people that can use its true power is someone who is like a yokai, which is, Onis are yokai, so a Japanese kind of like spirit, like some kind of person that's got to be connected to kind of like a very spiritual lineage because he is like half demon. And you see all of that in like the span of seconds, so you get like this whole fucking backstory. So I wonder to myself, no wonder he's so violent. 
Tsuki is going to pipe up and say, this is the worst thing I've ever felt. <laughs> all right. How's so, Maddie? What is Maddie just watching all of this happen? What's I was going to say that Maddie's definitely in the group hug. Let's go. Uh, I feel like he's he's definitely like in sort of he's definitely not reciprocating it, but he's less adamant about it and more just kind of like, oh man, this is this is this it. Is, this is what's going on now. <laughs> So, with you now that you guys are kind of like uh, uh, emotionally revitalized and a little bit grossed out, <laughs> uh, let me say you could, uh, if you guys want to, you can start ma making your way out of the warehouse. Finally, sure. All right. Well, I, I, you guys can. I'm gonna say that unless you guys had something else you wanted to do here, you'll you start making your way out of the warehouse. I like what Freela said. Man gets to see a trailer for the bloodiest anime of all time. <laughs> that's fucking. That's great. I love Freelance's little comments. They're great. They're great. <laughs> so, uh, you guys, you guys head outside and. You kind of you make it towards the alley, where you see like a you see like a group of men in just these kind of like just these sort of like they almost look like weird kind of like combat suits almost like almost like like sort of like just kind of like this mechanical looking armor. All right. Oh, sorry, sorry, dude, sorry, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> my bad, dude. <laughs> And they kind of like they kind of uh, when they when they notice you, they sort of like stop what they're talking about and kind of turn towards you, just being like, "Uh, excuse me, what? Where? Are... So, what are what are your what are your folks' names?" Folks, what are you talking about? I'm Benson. Okay, then. Okay, then. Let's start with you. Let's start with you, blue guy. What's your name? My name is Sukigawa. Well, Sukigawa... Don't you ever call me blue guy. Ever. Well, Sukigawa, we're, uh, we're with the Sparkholm Council of Defense. We're investigating what seems to be some kind of uh, some kind of altercation that seemed to be happening at the Rusty Mug Tavern not too far from here. We'd like to ask you and your friends here a couple of questions next time on RPG. Uh, oh, don't pull out the sword. Uh, <laughs> don't pull out the sword. sword. No, can I get one last thing in? No, no, no. I'll serve for later. God damn it. I... <laughs> He wasn't gonna start shit, but damn it, I had a good comeback for that. I just gotta remember. I'm so. Next time. I, oh my god, I'm so glad you guys started talking because I was like, I was like, I really wanted to end it on the. I really wanted to end it on the cops questioning you guys, but I was like, <laughs> but I really wanted to end it on the cops questioning you guys, but it was like 4:40, and I'm like, shit, how am I gonna, how am I gonna pad 20 minutes? <laughs> we 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 I got you. We're, we're, we're ending half an hour early. <laughs> no, we're it's not. Two it's hours. not. Yeah, we started. I thought we always end. I thought we always no. ended at five thirty. No, that's because we. That's because we usually talk for half an hour. No, yeah, uh, warm up. My bad. We started pretty quick today. Actually, now you mention it. We we actually started like very quick. I'm True. I'm, I'm proud of us. Yeah, yeah, we're only like five session. minutes late. Oh, Definitely. I'm fucking taking this intelligence off for I forget too. Yeah, I was trying to. I was trying to think yeah. of like what fucking thing I could take it off. Like, like, Promise me you, the whole session, but. <laughs> If, if, if you if you don't mind, could you actually send me a sheet with that update? Oh yeah, I will. because I because I, I do keep your guys' sheets up while during the campaign just so I'm I can having, reference them if I need to. Can I just say I'm having a lot of fun playing a very different kind of character than I usually do. It is. Fun. I really. I hope I'm not being 
I'm no. trying to I am I'm trying to walk a line of him being in character but not like out of character like bringing down like what the party wants to do. I hope that's okay. I, I just really like how your character is like yeah, I come from a land of murder hobos. <laughs> <laughs> but I just I mean I hope I, I hope I, I hope I'm not making the campaign unfun no. out of character no, no, no. even though he himself is a no fun kind of guy. I no, I'm a, I I can murder hobo, that. murder hobo that does have a home is a very interesting. <laughs> the, mur- the home of murder, murder hobo that has to he's, put up he's with a. Ju- he's just a murder. <laughs> murder hobo <laughs> that has to put up with people that care about him is really funny. Murder hobo and his companion, the Giving Tree. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Damn, dude. He's not, gonna, he's not trying to murder everyone. He's trying to intimidate most people, but most yeah, people yeah, just yeah. don't get it. They just don't get out of the way. A lot People have been, like, weirdly successful on your intimidation flips. Which, which has, makes me which... upset because I wanted him to be... I wanted that to be, like, a core part of his character. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well. You think it makes, I mean, there's always... Sense to, like, remove void and put... Keep, it, keep engineering? Yeah, it's up to you, isn't it? Yeah. I'm glad. You know what? I was actually, if I can say out of character, I was waiting to reveal that Suki wanted to kill their dad. I'm glad that actually came up very naturally by someone else. Like, that that was like, someone asked that, and I'm like, yes, I finally get to fucking drop this bomb that I was waiting on since the first, since we first started. And the I, reaction thought all, I thought we'd all want to kill him. And I love the reaction is sort of a mixed, eh, like it's not overwhelmingly on the same side or overwhelmingly against it. I think that's extra funny. Nathan's just like, you need a fucking hug, bro? <laughs> He's like, oh, come on, bring it in. I think Dude, Ben's very much on the side of violence, but uh, maybe to, not to that degree. You need to fucking <laughs> talk more, Freelance. You're fucking, I mean, I'm trying I not to you. talk over people, so I'm just going to keep it quiet until I can see oh, what I'm sorry. Out. No, no, you're sorry for not letting you talk. If you got something way. to say, no, it's not just bad. say it. I don't yeah. like to like step over people when I talk, so it's, it's it makes things more natural. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I talk over everybody. I, I yeah. you know, I don't respect anybody. Yeah, we know that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I, the, you... <laughs> I was kind of forewarned about it anyway from uh, Dingle, so I'm not really seething about it. I'm just like, okay, I'll wait. For my... It's it's like I'll, I'll probably just come out of it once I get like more familiarized. Fair, fair. You're good. Yeah, also, I mean, it's, I mean it's, it's 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 the second it's the it's the second session with this group. Got it. There's some there's some leg finding involved. I mean, I was like that it, for it, every it, season before this until I was DM, and I was like, "Oh, I should just be talking." It's it's fun. Just scream like, like ah! so. This was it was this session has been really th- these sessions have been really fun though. I'm really liking this. Yeah. I'm glad. Yeah, this have is you great played D and D before freelance? Like any tabletop I, games? I haven't played D and D. I've played Warhammer Fantasy once. Um, I I played a Warcraft campaign on the Genesis. Uh, I don't know what you call that system. And I'm currently like out like on Saturdays or every other Saturday. I'm playing a Vampire the Masquerade campaign right now. And now you're with us. Yes. And now I got the, the only thing I got used to is just like the card flipping system. But it's not really that. Complicated. I really like it. I like it more. I like it. I'm getting it's honest. not, it's I like not it that it's complicated, than... but it's definitely different compared to yeah. like dice. Yeah, I really, it's, I, like I a actually, different, it's a different vibe compared to dice for sure. A part of me really enjoys it over D anD D for just how flexible you can be with what you want to do. Like it's very creative. I do, well, I, brought, I do, yeah. I, am I brought a fan it up. I, I brought it up like when I into this. I'm like, I don't know why D anD D is like the go to for a lot of people when they're like trying to when they think tabletop. I think D anD D, and I'm like, D anD D seems like retardedly overcomplicated. It's yeah. just you know, it's just the biggest. It's been around the longest. Yeah. I love D&D. D&D is not, oh. Number one, D and D is very, extremely fucking far from the most complicated tabletop. Not the game. not the most complicated, but well, what would you say D&D. is the most complicated? Hey guys, guys, you guys, our next, guys, guys, our next, our our next session, we're doing it in Fatal. No, uh, I, I'll, I'm rolling for anal circumference. <laughs> uh, I'm I on bet. it. It's like when you get arrested in San Andreas, the cop says, don't worry, your asshole can stretch. No. <laughs> God, GTA San Andreas is so fun. It makes me feel old thinking about it now. Some he really said old. fuck 12 at the end of this campaign. Yeah, my mom used to <laughs> play at the end of the session, I mean. You guys are old. All right. Fucking nerds. Anyways. Uh, so, 
I think we can do hero points. Give me last. I'm going to use the bathroom. I'll do first. Right. I want to be first. First, yeah. first. You guys, are first all, you guys are all getting one from me. It's a great session for this. Nice. You know what you I did didn't get a chance. You know what's crazy? I didn't get a, I didn't get a chance to dramatic failure. I did not have any straight number flips Dude, this entire time. That, that was me for like the first like, 10 sessions of the last game. <laughs> oh, yeah. It is, who did dramatic failure this time? I, I think I know Zedrin had two. I didn't get to dramatic failure. I know, uh, I'm pretty sure. Did. Yes, no, no, did no. not. I think Cynical did. Like, Cynical did one, and then Freelance didn't do one at the same time. I didn't even get a chance to use that. Was that I didn't even no, get a chance yeah, that to use Joker. Okay, yeah, then it was just Sedge in this session, I think. I didn't get a chance to use the anti Joker for anything. That's kind of crazy. Well, it just means you get to keep it. That's what I always do. Oh, hell yeah. I never keep this shit. Nah, use it or lose it. Nah, I can't. That's, keep not, it. that's, ne that's literally never how we've done it. Yeah, you don't get to change that's literally the rules how just hero it's points me. work. Yeah, but uh, uh, hero no, points not, and, and anti jokers are not the same thing. Hello, they're called different things. Alas. Yeah, I was right. talking about the anti joker. So, Brown, who are your heroes for this session? Oh, I actually do get to do it now. Okay, my heroes for this session. Oh, <laughs> man. Dude, I gotta give one. Bro, I mean, you know I gotta give one to Zed for ghost riding the whip. I mean, <laughs> you know, bro, riding the whip. I mean, bro. Oh, man, the second that one, dude. Teamwork. I think I'll give the second one to Bit, dude. For the oh. fucking stealing the fedora hat and fucking Psychama. Yeah, yeah. Psychoma. I don't get a hero point because I'm not wearing a fedora. Yeah, Psychama mature story. Well, I'm also, I was saying it's also I mean, for the Yeah, you, you killed the guy, but you don't take it. So that's yeah. that's free uh, free pickings. Mm. That's how you can tell he's just a murderer, not a murder hobo, because he doesn't just steal everything off the dead people, <laughs> as a hobo would be wont to do. I feel like I want to like try to take something at least once a session. Huh? <laughs> just so I can add something dumb to my inventory every session. That's a good goal. It, it can be fun, yeah. I was telling my. I don't know if I told you guys about this, but I was telling my fucking other DM about this shit where it's like, gotta, gotta give shit that's like, I'm not gonna get it anywhere else. Like, it's like, it needs to be a reward or like something that shows up suddenly that I'm just like, oh, I want that. And then uh, maybe I'll use it for something interesting later on. It can't just be like, oh, it's a magic shop that has all the magic items you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. fucking, like, I can't, I don't know what I want them, but like, if you fucking put a, if you put a bottle in front of me and you say it fucking makes one arm really big, I'll find a way to use that. You know what I mean? True. That's different. I mean, those cans. You fucking went so hard with those cans. Yeah, hey, those cans were funny. Dude, those cans put in the a lot of fucking work. The cans put in a ton of work. <laughs> it helped that I had 33 of them. Yeah. Before, I, can't remember. I can go next. Large amount. I got a right. cynical for constantly wanting the smoke with every NPC. Yeah. Yeah. He does <laughs> not give combat. a fuck. He wants that smoke. And oh. another one to brown for many actions this session, but especially the group hug as a car. <laughs> By rounding <laughs> everyone up and opening your car door. <laughs> that was yeah, pretty it's dope. fun being a car. It's actually really fun to think about how to describe actions because I'm a car from cars. But not. But what do you mean, but not? Yeah, no relation. To Lightning McQueen. Yeah. I'm Even from, your car, last I'm name from is the Cars world. Oh, you are from, from me. My okay. last name's McQueen, no relation. Okay, okay. Y'all done? Which, you know, so is more important no, to we've say. No, we've only done two people. Okay, good, good, good. I want to make sure I wasn't, like, holding everybody up. It's over, no. dude. It's already over. Oh, oh. All right. Uh, Cynical. Me? Yeah. Uh, we're all me. To 
I'm going to give one to Nathan because I liked him just being shot at and not even realizing. I thought that was really <laughs> funny. <laughs> that was it a good actually, bit. It kind of ruins my brain a little bit. He's named Nathan. I like, and you I know, know what? I, figured, I, I realized that I figured that must be confusing as shit for you. Yeah, it's, it's not too me. bad because I hate being called Nathan. And, yeah, yeah, that's why I intentionally call you Nathan sometimes. I'm, yeah, okay. I, I'm well aware. My Nasty second Nathan. hero is important, fellas. Benson, because without Benson jokering early on, we would have never gotten Maddie. <laughs> <laughs> that is important. Mind Mind out of character, yeah. in character, Suki does not care what happens to Maddie. Uh, out of character, I really want to see what happens now that we kind of have an NPC follower slash hostage. Hostage. <laughs> hostage. I also <laughs> like it when Freelance fucking posted like a uh, second hostage acquired. That quite that just made me, you know what that just made me think too? Like how funny that would be if like if like we're in the we're with the cops and then like, and then Maddie just says like, like these guys like, are not oh, letting me go. Maddie's like I don't know these guys and then we take him hostage but like whispering is here like oh we're not really gonna hurt you. We'll fucking kill him. We'll kill him right now. <laughs> yeah, Bro, no, spoilers, actually that's amazing. Spoilers. Remember that for next session. Remember that oh, for next god. session. Oh god. <laughs> but yeah, so it's uh, it's freelance and Zedjin. I'll I'll say the usernames because I don't want to confuse Bram. All right. Uh, Zell, how about you, Zell? What do you think? I like going all to want to sin for giving me that sick uh, commercial break. Uh, <laughs> shame I, I, oh, I yeah. wasn't, wasn't able to make full use of it by like flipping with your sword, but I wanted to use that at some point. Yeah, no, I <laughs> like Freelance's comment. You just got a trailer to the bloodiest anime of all time. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and, and I think it does uh, does help a bit get uh, get more context right, for yeah. why you are why you are very you angry are the way you are <laughs> that's the that's the nicest way to put it yeah um second one gotta be dancing as well because fucking i'm surprised no one mentioned the the healing bit <laughs> uh, that was i fucking forgot to say it shit i was it's because i wanted to say ghost riding the whip so bad yeah yeah but I did have it. Uh, I do have it written down here. Plugging holes with this that fucking is a very mouth. funny bit uh, of just healing people in a way that's so gross that <laughs> <laughs> they just don't want to. <laughs> like, take them out, take them out, please. <laughs> They'd rather be wounded than have me healed. <laughs> <laughs> I rattle now. <laughs> What's that rat? I'm like driving down the road. What's that rattling? Just <laughs> speaking out customer, of my door. Customer states he hears rattling of the door panel whenever he goes over 40 miles an hour. <laughs> <laughs> I need, I need a mechanic to cool. All right, freelance. All right, freelance. Round us Go out. Ahead. Feels really fun. Also, awful, next. Right? Next session, can we do it? The secret is I have six initiatives now. I swear in my life, Brown's character is fucking awkward to me as somebody who worked as a mechanic before, like a couple years ago. Um, give me uh, some I'll good bits. DM them to me if you got if you got, if you got yeah, some good stuff. Ponder, DM it to me. Ponder over them. Yeah, there's a crack in your oil pan if you take a critical hit, so you're just leaking oil. <laughs> um, I'll give my points to um, Sin uh, Suki for. I, I, it probably sounded like I was coming off harsh when I was like, oh, he's going straight to violence, but I actually like that. Like, it, it, that's like not me complaining because it's just character interaction. Like, no, I like it because you're, I, I want to say autistic, but that sounds mean, but you know, like, obviously <laughs> you've got a one track mind with uh, find dad, kill dad. And I, I, based, I think TVH, I, I enjoy how it's like, this could be a speech check or whatever. No, it's just going right to violence. He's not finishing the fucking countdown. Let's fucking go. Like, okay. Oh, yeah. The countdown I was really happy with. I am so glad. I was like, <laughs> it's like two, I'm going to come down before it gets to three. I really liked that. That was pretty funny. Yeah, that that, that, that set the scene perfectly for the uh, retarded shenanigans that happened, like especially on the other side of the fucking warehouse. And um, I'm gonna give a point to Benson, as somebody else mentioned, for the healing bit and just the comment he made after. But like, doesn't this look so cool next to your place? Is so happy, even though he's fucking disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> 
And him cracking during the group hug, too. Oh, that was funny. Yeah. My mental, uh, my yeah, that... is like Benson's got the mentality of like a six year old, but he's so damn. Fucking... I should have gone last, dude. I had Nathan on here too. I thought, damn, dude, you had yourself on there. No, I had <laughs> his. Shut up. Yeah, I, I totally just like reverse ate a key. I like to don't call me Nathan, Alex. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, I will say that uh, Cynical and Zedrin, as of this session, have an XP now. Yeah, oh, boy! Nice. I'm jelly. I'm fucking jelly. We on the grind. Everyone else is halfway, but they not they, because they've both because they both like because like uh, Cynical got Cynical like a I double a dramatic, dramatic failure. failure. Yeah, yeah. You double dramatic failure last session, and Zedrin double dramatic failure this session. But for some reason, I, for some fucking reason, I, I couldn't, yeah, well, not for some reason, but having no straight number rolls means I could not dramatic failure this session, which kind of stunk. True. Because dramatic it's... failure is honestly really funny. Now do that eight. like eight times in a row. <clears throat> Dude, I'll if just dramatic bad, failure the... all the Dude, time, whoever... every time, because there is no whoever limit doesn't... to dramatic failure. Whoever doesn't get Mr. Adam with their first XP is a bitch. Just saying. I'm not I'm not wasting my miss. I'm not wasting my XP for that shit. Mm, nah, so I'm going for friendship up. speech. <laughs> no. mm, bitch. That was really fun though. I was really looking forward to that. This I was really looking forward to this. Dude, if I do if I get Mr. Adam with my first XP, which I'm now going to do when the time comes, it better be a fucking car item, dude. <laughs> you get new rims. Uh, that's what I was thinking. Spinner rims, or like, uh, or like, uh, or like the yo, this he got the ice on his car, though, or like the horns that they put, like those horns they put on the front of uh, cars. Oh. Yeah. He's yeah, going full on like aftermarket Honda fucking meta game, <laughs> or like, a, or like a fucking um, like a cat, one of those things. The bump. What are those fucking? It's like the the tubes they put on. Like, no, they put them on the front. Of, no, like, you know what you need? You need to get those. Yeah, um, you need to get the thing where um, you need to get the adjustable like uh, axle so it can be like real low to the ground or real high. Oh, hydraulics. Oh, yeah, I got, yeah, I got hydraulics. hydraulics. I, I, like, I, I like the potential of an arc of just like <laughs> Brown spending all his XP on mystery items and he just becomes a ricer by the end of the campaign. It's literally like I've hit my ride over the course of like 20 seconds. Uh, I, I, I like the idea of him having chrome, yeah. I like the idea of him having spinners and this can be used to like dazzle enemies or fucking like blind them for a turn or some shit. shit. I just I like the I just like the idea that every item I get has to be like something a car can use. Oh it has to be. Of course. Because otherwise it's but like, yeah, you uh fun. Then you better start dramatic failuring every time, then Brown, so you can. He already it. does. You just, you know, I do. Yeah. I just haven't had the chance at all. This is luck of the draw. That's how it goes. That's you got to do more uh, one card flips. Believe me, I was looking out for him like all game. Hey yo, I need to do more small flips. I do have a lot of shit that I can fail on too. I'm just doing good. I gotta heal my boy. I'm kind of glad I went with the whole tank route because I'm like, yeah, I just lost half my health. Oh, One go. Yeah, you know, it's really fun. this is this has given me this has given me good data on on what you guys consider threats <laughs> because <laughs> yeah. my my whole thought process with that like rain of bullets was like, oh, this is gonna be this is gonna be an interesting little puzzle for them to the solve of how are they Let's gonna just get run through. How, how, are they, how are they gonna get how are they gonna get to the warehouse when they're like constantly shooting the space in front of it? And then you guys are like, yeah, I'm gonna run in. I'm a car, dude. The fuck you think I'm scared he goes bullets? rides the whip. Uh, when you're honestly, at- yeah, if you didn't drive through the door. He uh, goes through like he goes that whole combat would have gone a, a hell of a lot different. I will say, when you're a hammer, every problem looks like a fucking nail. That's what yeah. I was thinking too. That's what I was thinking too. Well, though, Dingle, like... you've played with so many, you've played so many campaigns with us. You have to know it by now that if you put it like a problem in front of us, we will not be critically thinking. Tr- trust me, 
I uh, mean, this is anything like, you expect will always change or always turn out differently. This no was, matter if this you're was, expecting this was, it to go off the rails. This was uniquely brute forcey, even for you guys. You just <laughs> let yourselves get shot. <laughs> totally <laughs> worth it. Not more worked fucking. Out, listen, out. listen. You gotta understand. We really want to find our dad. Fun fact, you can shoot down a tree with a Tommy gun. All, all the damage I took this session was undodgeable. Otherwise, I would have just I would have just swerved around the bullets going at Mach 6. Uh, you would have yeah. swerved. At Mach what? Your car can't get up to Mach whatever. Not uh, yet. I go speed racer yet. style. Not yet. Wait till we get those aftermarket parts on them. Wait yeah, till we get the yeah. fucking nitrous injection. Put a fucking turbo on me, boys. Nathan's just like going into combat like a tank from Left 4 Dead. <laughs> it don't even matter. You just walk and dun, 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 dun. I just like put up the trailer for like the tree men from uh, like one of the Warhammer awesome. strategy games where it's, yeah. they're just fucking screaming and just like stomping the shit out of everything. That's gonna be my fucking like combat mentality is just like be line <laughs> and crush. You're an ant and I'm like one of those uh one of those minivans in a crowd of people. Just gonna, I'm just like imagine like I'm gonna be re rewatching like the second Lord of the Rings movie just for the March of the Ends. Well, I gotta head out, you, fellas. Dude. Yeah, I gotta go. I gotta go to the bank, so I'm gonna head out as well. The bank? I gotta go to the bank. Yeah. The bank? Go. He's, gotta pay, he's gotta pay back that guy for the. He's, yeah, he's gotta go that? get. Oh. He's gotta go get Jimmy's money or whatever his name. Yeah, is. I'm about to say Billy. I can't let my second hostage die. We let him go, dude. I fucking love. One thing before I go, I love the thing of like, wait, this guy isn't our dad. Let's just get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. Yeah, I love that. Was good too. <laughs> like David's like, can we fucking try to something? All right, I gotta go. You said what? See ya. Yeah, see you guys. See you boys.